trying to impress the opposite sex, I see. A modern-day mating ritual. Brilliant. Nothing a little wintergreen oil won't fix. Learn from your mistakes and you will never fail. All right. In a hurry, I see. Pay some mind to your surroundings. Where's your mind? Pay attention now, little ninny. Bloody hell. You broke my train of thought. Inconsiderate lout. Daft little brat. Get stuff, you bleeding wanker. Nitwit. What is the meaning of this? Does this amuse you? You cannot trample me like an elephant. Bugger. I will not stand for this. Looks like I finally found a little helper to Polish my globes. If you can name all 194 countries, I will let you go. <laughs> this hurts me as much as you, Jimmy. If you put as much effort into learning as troublemaking, you'd be a prodigy. Whoever you are, I've got you. You've opened a world of trouble for yourself. Well, I'm off to explore the world over the internet. Tally-ho! I must be off, Jimmy. Good day. Yes, the island must be two degrees off. Jimbo, I must leave. Bye. I am forever grateful. Help! Prefix! Teachers! Hey! You! Come help me! I am on course to intercept you! Stop you, nest little ninny! And the adventurer evades the hostile tribe. Looks like you got away, huh? Way to state the obvious. Curse you! Jimmy curses! Charter the flight. Get the raft, open seas all the way. See one volcano, see them all, I say. Can't name all 50 states? What a waste. I would have had the idol if it weren't for that massive boulder. Two degrees west of the Andes? Oh, the Himalayas. Maybe father's right. I should go back to the family farm. Can you believe it? I am at my wit's end. I am not okay. I am losing my marbles here. Hmm. Strange indeed. That is remarkable. Good show. Yes. Well, do you want to hear something else interesting? Nobody at this school cares about world exploration. Geography is about Mother Earth's brilliant curves, not a big rock. You must look at what you can do for the Earth, not what the Earth can do for you. Borders are imaginary. I prefer fault lines. I still can't get updated maps approved in the budget. I can't believe most of these students never venture past the view of a telly. I bet the new students will be as dim-witted as always. The Earth will one day regain her glory when man flees or destroys himself. I hear there's some territorial fighting between the cliques going on. American football is reminiscent of a battle I once saw in the South Pacific between two warring tribes. That Jimmy reminds me of a young Napoleon. I I find it enlightening to know that the explorer's spirit lives on. Just look at how inaccessible that latest piece of graffiti is. Brilliant. An interesting thought. You've got something there. You may be onto something. I haven't seen it in that light before. The Earth will eventually wage war with humanity. We are something of a disease. I feel so incredibly cramped on campus. I need to explore more often. I don't understand what it is about me that isn't painfully attractive to potential mates. If my eyes weren't as atrocious as they are, I would have had a brilliant career as an explorer. Sounds pathetic. You cannot overstep your bounds. If only you could see the larger picture. Well, it'll do you no good talking to me. I'm a certifiable old bugger. Thank goodness my eyesight is freeing or I'd have to spend my life watching the telly like the lot of you. There is no pioneering spirit left in America. I can only hope the children back in Britain aren't as horrible as they are here. The world shall purge itself of human impurity. It is simply a matter of time. Be seeing you. Talk to you later. Have a great day. I think my next expedition will make it to the base camp. Only two years before I've saved enough for the Antarctic adventure. I'm over the hill, and yet I've only been to 128 of the 194 countries. Did you know I've toured both the seven old wonders of the world as well as the seven new wonders of the world? Quite amazing, I should say. Remarkable. Good to hear. Well, at least you're modest. Have you ever seen the sunset from Everest? Have you ever noticed how people flock to fault lines, yet are surprised when disaster strikes? Have you ever wished you could cradle the earth in your arms? Have you ever been caving? When you emerge, it's like Mother Earth just gave birth to you. Once, in my youth, after a few loggers, I might have at some point. I don't really feel comfortable answering that. No, but I have stepped or sailed on every continent and ocean on Earth. That is disgustingly fascinating. We are comrades, Jimmy. Do you think the Nina would have fired on the Santa Maria? No, so stop. For heaven's sake, cut it out. You've crossed the line. You are a complete disgrace. You! Uh, what is wrong with the world? Breeding Pratt! I should have worked for planetary geographer. The wind has left these old sails. It's all fading, slowly, 
fading. I despise you. I will have revenge. This is an outrage. <coughs> That's quite enough. I will not stand for this. I am not pleased at all. In some countries, this is a sign of respect. In ancient cultures, saliva was used to ferment alcohol. What is happening? Are those students? I wish I could see. I love a good punch-up, like the gazelle fighting for dominance over his father. What is this rubbish? Who's that? Who did it? Good day, everyone. I'm Mr. Matthews, your geography teacher. I know you're all enthusiastic and ready to learn. Otherwise, why would you be here? Everyone to your seats, please. It's a big world we've got to cover today. Don't forget, class. Geography is where it's at. Good news, class. Today we will be looking at some exciting new maps. Can you believe it? Good morning, my little cartographers. If at first you don't succeed, try, try again. I hope this isn't the beginning of a trend, Hopkins. Don't give up. Even Christopher Columbus got lost on his way to India. Hopkins, is that map upside down? Well, at least you showed up for class. Try again. Are you sure about that? No, I'm sorry that it is incorrect. Hmm, a fair guess. But I'm afraid it's wrong. Heavens! Whatever gave you that idea? You've charted a fine course for yourself, son. Bravo! Nicely done, Hopkins! Well, well. Someone's been paying attention, it seems. By Jove, you've done it, Hopkins! Hopkins, my boy. I'm afraid I've underestimated you. Congratulations! You've passed my class. Hey, uh, Jimmy, can you lend me some money for geography textbooks? Uh, Jimmy, it seems my rent money is short this month. Mind if I borrow some? Thank you. I appreciate it, Jimmy. Here you are, my son. All right. Cheers. Hello. I believe you're the only one I can trust. I appreciate your help, Jimmy. Honest. Young man, I could use some assistance. I am in dire need of your help. I would be indebted to you, Jimmy. You will not rouse a reaction out of me. I cannot be bothered by your nonsense. Could you please bugger off someplace? Are you proud of yourself? I bet you think you're smart. Well, you're not, brainless little savage. <laughs> you're a manky little wanker. Oh, <laughs> hilarious. Oh, my. Where would you even get this? My word, I mean, does someone this age even know what this is? <laughs> Next thing you know, Crabble Snitch will be wiretapping the phones. I want him to pay like no one's paid before. I don't feel... <laughs> a rat? Did you know rats were quite common stowaways on the great explorer's ships? No time to chat, Jimmy. Shush up, I'm thinking. Wait until class to bother me, Jimmy. Is that Jimmy? Mr. Hopkins, lovely to hear your voice. Not causing trouble, are you, Jimmy? This is not permissible. That's enough. Enough already. I'm wondering if discovering a new world feels like this. Wow, that is remarkable. I was expecting great things. Hmm, I think I'd have more fun watching the clock. No! Why? You didn't have to do that. Attention-seeking ninny. You're a disgrace. Oh, my. Sometimes it amazes me the world still goes around. I could have predicted this was going to happen to me. Beautiful and destructive. Reminds me of a woman I knew. Boom! Bang! Ha 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 Smells like the rotting flesh of a corpse. I may be sick from that. I think I hit the sauce a little hard today. Whatever it was... It's gone now. Maybe it was a little rat or some piss. You're not that sneaky, little boy. Do you happen to think you're invisible? I can't wait to hear your excuse. What in green earth was that? Some sort of rustling over this way. Hello? Is there anyone there? That's it, Jimmy! You're in trouble now! You stupid little boy! Hold your horses! You! Stop! Hopkins! Oh, we've got a little disappearing act now. You are in my class, Jimmy. I'll get you eventually. Where did the little weasel get to? Oh my, now that is not art. Go scuff up your own property, boy. I can't believe it. Is that all? Don't tell me. Go get even. I think you may be exaggerating, yes? You primitive. You hooligans are all the same. Get a load of this. I'll turn you seven shades of pink. You are a waste of air. You obnoxious prat. I demand that you cease your belligerence immediately. I am not impressed, not one bit. I will personally drag you down to detention. This is a mutiny. You've taken tackiness to a new level. Did you have an accident with scissors? Did your other pants get ripped? I'd rather see your wretched feet than look at those shoes another second. It takes 
bollocks to wear that kit, inking your epidermis just as the tribes of the Amazon? <laughs> what kind of hazing have you been involved with? I thought you might grow up to be a great adventurer, Jimmy. I was wrong. Yes, yes, try again sometime when I care. I beg your pardon? You'd like to fail my class? No problem at all. Can I get back to ignoring you now? You are nothing but a little speck on the surface of my world. The words of a boy will not affect me. Oh, Jimmy. Wait until you have hair on your chest before you start flapping your mouth off. Don't you have better things to do? Are you looking to fail my class? Gary used that line on me this morning. Stop vying for dominance, Jimmy. You haven't hit puberty yet. Jimmy, stick to my side. Follow me. Come along. I am forever grateful. What is on your head? Cheers. You have no sense of direction. This way. Come back here. This way. Get to the dorm. You know you shouldn't be out here at this time. Go get some rest. Aren't you supposed to be home in bed? You shouldn't be out this late. I'm gonna get you now. I've headed up to here. I can't turn a blind eye all the time. You give me no choice, Miss Crayant. Do not move. You're in it big time now. It's almost time for class. Let's go. Run along. Classes begin soon. It's almost time to learn. Get going. Start making your way towards class. Let's move, children. Class time. Bloody hell. You're not helping anybody. Oh, behave. Come on, respect the law. Stop being such a pain. I'm going to have to ask you to cut that out. You can't be here. You're breaking the rules, kid. Run along. Last time I checked, you weren't allowed here. What's going on here? What's the big idea here? Oh, I'd cut class if I had hat trick too. You love pissing away mums and dads' money, don't you? Too busy to learn? Why don't you get to class and I won't tell? You are what's wrong with this school. No ambition. What in blazes is the meaning? of that. Are you planning a mutiny? That better be a toy. I hope that is a replica of some kind. If I hear you use that against someone, you'll pay. Why am I destined to be of no significance? Hmm. I wonder what it could be.